Hello, parents of the politics class of 2021. Hope everybody's having a great week. I'm not sure when you'll receive this, but if, if it's in the morning, hope you're having a great morning. If it's night, hope you're having a great night. Uh, I'm going to run through a couple slides about the class this year, about politics 2021. Um, so here we go. Okay, general class overview. Okay, so first of all, this class is divided into a two semester course. First semester is international politics. Second semester will concentrate on United States politics. Uh, both semesters will also focus on current events, especially the 2020 U.S. elections, federal, state, and local, as well as any other events that come up. Uh, the next two slides will discuss what each semester will cover. But first, a little information about myself. I am Bill Gallier. Um, this is my email address is billgallieratseabrookacademy.org. My phone number is 785-691-6392. Please reach out anytime. Uh, I usually keep up with my email until around 8 o'clock at night. Uh, you can also text me anytime you'd like to. Uh, text is probably better than call. I got to admit, if I ever get a phone number, I don't know what it is. I don't answer it. So a text is probably the best way to reach out. But please feel free to reach out anytime you would like. Okay, now let's get to kind of what we're going to cover uh, with each of the semesters. Okay, first semester, we'll be talking about international politics. We'll be studying the countries of Great Britain, China, Iran, and Russia. We'll also do a self-study of Mexico and Nigeria. Uh, themes we'll be looking at with each of these nation states is sovereignty, authority, and power. We'll be looking at political and economic change, citizen society in the state, the political institutions, as well as, as, well as public policy. Okay, uh, we will, those are the themes we'll be looking at each of those countries through. Uh, we'll be looking at the first thing we'll do, if you look here, topics covered, this is kind of a breakdown of the weeks by the semester. Uh, we're going to spend the first week or two discovers, talking about the international world today and the year 2020. Uh, we'll be looking at the comparative method in defining the themes for four weeks, and then we'll be studying each of the nation states for nine weeks. Uh, there'll be a self-study toward the end of the semester, uh, and then there'll be a semester exam, which will be the last very week of the semester. Uh, we'll also, of course, be covering the 2020 elections United States elections all throughout this semester. Okay, semester two, uh, which we will switch over to the United States government as well as doing a project at the Dole Institute. Uh, second semester we'll be covering with, with this, we'll be covering the Constitution for a week, we'll be looking at the legislature, the executive, the judiciary, we'll be spending a week on federalism, we're we'll talking about the political parties, the history of each party as well as how the parties re interact today, a look at economic policy, we'll look at the media, government, and politics, as well as civil liberties and civil rights. There's also a semester project, uh, which we'll be doing at the Dole Institute of Politics. Um, we'll go there in February for a meeting to learn how to use the archives, and then we'll be doing the project April through May. Uh, basically what they do is they figure out a topic, they, they set up times to go. Uh, this is a very, it's a very independent project. They can do it by themselves or in groups of up to four. Uh, we've really been successful with it. I've been doing it now for 10 years. Please let me know if you have any other questions, but they, the kids will not get anything about this until February of 2021. Okay, so, and here is the Schoology page um, that the kid, that you can look at as well as your students. Uh, you can see here we've got, this is the weekly assignments and classwork. Anything going on that week or homework that week will be in this folder right here. Uh, this is all our expectations and your syllabus are here. All the class worksheets will be in this folder. Class quizzes will be in this folder, reading assignments here, any PowerPoints we do will be here. And you can see now we actually are doing a blog discussion on the Democratic National Convention um, that they are working on as well right now. Uh, over here you can see the calendar. They can click this up and open the calendar and have a calendar. So that is how the Schoology page will look. Uh, we've gone over this in class, so I, I think they've pretty much got a pretty good, pretty good coverage of it. And finally, we'll wrap up kind of what we've been doing the first couple weeks. Uh, we started the class by discussing a lot about expectations. Uh, we did this in breakout rooms. The reason we spent time on that, and they weren't real excited about it, but the reason we spent time on it is this class, this class is based a lot on discussion. And so we spent time setting up how discussion should be, and that way we can know how when we get into class discussion, we can have a respectful discussion about whatever topic we're talking about. They also worked out, they worked in breakout rooms on introductory worksheet, uh, which answered a lot of questions about federal and local elections. Um, and we're, we went over that in class, and they're going to answer some questions about that worksheet. And then the first reading assignment um, in the textbook is due Thursday, August 27th. So that's kind of what we've been doing to start out with. Uh, like I said, please don't hesitate to contact me with any questions or concerns or anything like that. Uh, thank you very much for listening. I hope you have a great day.